गाइस दिस इज मालिंकी वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल वॉइस ऑफ मालिंकी टुडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट ग्रीन हाउस इफेक्ट एंड ग्लोबल वार्मिंग एंड इफ यू आर न्यू इन माय चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड इफ यू लाइक माय वीडियो प्लीज टू लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर माय वीडियो सो अ ग्रीन हाउस इज अ हाउस मेड अप ऑफ ग्लास व्हिच इज यूज्ड टू ग्रो प्लांट्स नाउ इन द ग्रीन हाउस air is trapped which absorbs radiations from sun and get warmer so the heat gets trapped since it cannot escape from the greenhouse well the temperature inside our greenhouse is always higher than the temperature outside this helps plants to grow now same happens in the earth's atmosphere although we are not covered by glass but by the blanket of air which is called atmosphere right now greenhouse gases of this atmosphere which surround our earth absorb heat from sun which makes the earth surface warmer since heat does not reflect back into the space this insulates the earth surface and it is essential for the survival of living beings in the earth right and this is called greenhouse effect since it maintains the temperature of earth and sustains life however due to increased level of greenhouse gases the earth gets warmer day by day which leads to many drastic effects so what are the greenhouse gases carbon dioxide methane ozone nitrous oxide and chlorofluorocarbons or cfcs are major greenhouse gases let's talk about the causes of greenhouse gases so the major causes of greenhouse effect are first is deforestation so plants we know that plants absorb CO2 during photosynthesis now cutting of trees and deforestation increases the CO2 level in air which eventually increases temperature second is burning of fossil fuels so fossil fuels such as coal and petroleum are widely used in transportation as well as in electricity generation now burning of fossil fuels releases co2 since our population size is increasing day by day population size is increasing day by day so utilization of fossil fuels is also increasing which ultimately results in increased temperature next is farming so nitrous oxide is used in the fertilizers and nitrous oxide is a greenhouse gas that we know so due to the increased application of fertilizers greenhouse effect is also increasing next is industrial waste so increased number of factories and industries are major contributors of greenhouse gases since they produce harmful greenhouse gases let's see what are the effects of greenhouse gases so first is uh, global warming so these are some major effects of greenhouse gases first is global warming now global warming is the process where gradual increase in earth's atmosphere occurs this leads to the 
melting of glaciers and polar ice caps and flooding of the coastal areas since sea level is getting increased right now global warming which increases the temperature of earth also increases the incidence of certain diseases such as malaria yellow fever dengue etc next is depletion of ozone layer so certain greenhouse gases such as chlorofluorocarbons or cfcs are responsible for depleting the ozone layer as they attack and destroy the ozone layer ozone layer is found in the stratosphere and protects life on earth by absorbing harmful uv radiation from sun and the depletion of ozone layer helps the harmful uv rays from sun to enter our earth surface which is lethal for living organisms next is smog and air pollution so smog is a kind of air pollution it is the mixture of smoke and fog now smog is generally formed by the accumulation of greenhouse gases along with agricultural fires forest fires automobile and industrial emission etc next is acidification of water bodies the greenhouse gases mix with rain water and fall as acid rain which is responsible for the acidification of water bodies such as river ponds lakes etc 